Welcome to Rob Art Design. Today we're going to be drawing a kaiju of my own design. This kaiju right here is something I came up with and we're going to show it to you in a sped up version because I know that you don't want to spend 35 minutes watching me draw this. Maybe you do. Anyway, the circle that I started was to pretty much figure out where the head was going to land. Once I did that, I didn't need to make any other lines. I started with the eye, and then the teeth, and the tongue, and now I'm drawing the lips stretched around the mouth. Now, like I was saying before, this video in real time took me about 30 minutes to do. That's because I didn't just do the line drawing, but I'm also going to do the shadowing inside. So right now I'm doing the line drawing. I'm doing a garden of spikes on his head to give it that menacing look. And once the line drawing is done, the shadowing part which is at the very end is going to be sped up really quick and that's so that we can make this video under six minutes so right now I'm making the large battle horns and I'm doing some detail on the face after I do the detail on the face I'm going to start doing the line work on the body now it's pretty much like the line work of a illustration for a comic book or something but the difference with this is that after I finish the line work I'm going to finish it off with some shading dark grays to white this is the hump on its back and I'm drawing the shoulders and the shoulder muscle now even though a couple of curved lines can automatically give the appearance of the thickness of the arm once I lay in the shadowing, it's gonna, and I hate to use the word because everybody uses it, it's gonna pop. Okay. Now, here are the hands. The hands is in an agitated position, just about to clench into fists. You usually get your either clenched fist monster or your open clawed monster. This guy, he's about to clench it into a fist so you could you know see the drama in the in the drawing the pectoral muscles which connect to the biceps pushed up against the biceps uh, gives it that tight look and quick lines give all the muscles a tight look now I'm going to do a couple of more uh, lines and then I'm gonna go right into the shading like I said the shading is gonna go really quick quicker than what you see here and that's because you do not want to be here for 10 20 30 minutes watching me do this if you do let me know if you don't let me know let me know how you feel about the videos and what you'd like to see uh, in the upcoming videos, I'm going to do a lot more monsters and zombies and things, and then I'm going to do tutorials like how to actually do it, which will not be sped up, so that you can get the idea of how I do these things. So here we go. The line drawing is done, and now I'm coming in with the shadowing. Pay close attention on how I lay down the shadow, even though it's going super quick. The magic of videos that you could stop at any time, look at it, rewind it, play it again. But I'm basically putting the darks on the lower parts of the body, and whatever stays white is where the light is focusing on it, giving it that 3D look. So the hands, I'm roughing it out so that 
you can see it better, it doesn't disappear in the darkness of his body. And that's how you do it. So here you have it, folks. The Kaiju. And there'll be more Kaijus to come behind this guy. So subscribe if you like, and if you subscribed already, thumbs up and all that jazz. Thanks for watching Rob Art Designs.